What's up guys, welcome to your 109th Android tutorial for the new Boston. And what we're going to do in this tutorial is basically the polishing up of our little application. It might be one more for this external data, then we'll be done. Um, but what I've realized is we haven't set up our edit text, um, that reference, so let's do that real quick. Otherwise our, our program is going to crash. So we're going to say save file, standard stuff here. So hopefully we won't get any uh, any errors. And what was that called? Et. Et save as, and there we go. Um, we have that set up. Now the other thing we need to do is we have to add a permission to our manifest so we can write to the external data. Um, or write externally. So we're just going to say add uses permission over here in the name. We're just going to click down, and scroll to the bottom, and uh, there's the choice write external storage. Hit save, and now we can write to the external storage. And another thing we can do is that we want to do is make sure that our actual path exists because we're going to be basically saving this to the you know the SD card. And then uh, we're going to get our path, which is either going to be kind of a directory for downloads, pictures, music. If that path doesn't exist, we want to create it so we can actually save some stuff within that folder. So how we do that is we just say path.mkdirs. And that will basically create a directory path for us if it doesn't exist. If it already does exist, it's not going to do anything. So it's a pretty simple way to create a folder um, wherever we want our path to, to lead. And uh, let's let's also add a toast within our within our try here. So what we're going to do, we've we've done toast before, but just to make our application a little bit you know better, we're going to say toast toast dot uh, make text context our class name which is called external data dot this text uh, file has been saved and duration toast dot long length or like length long I don't know Dys dyslexia or something I'm Liz Dexic and uh, and then we're just gonna hit T dot show so now we'll display a toast after we opened and closed our input and output streams. Now let's uh, check it for the most part. And then I'm going to show you guys uh, our application. But uh, I apologize if the camera, apologize if the quality is poor. Uh, you guys might not be able to see the actual phone or what I'm doing. But I'll try and talk through everything that I'm doing so you'll understand it. I'll catch you guys then. Peace. All right, so just ran the, the the application on my phone here, and first thing I want to show you guys is when we go to the external data right here, um, both of our our triggers are set to false. We can't read or write, and that's because we have the SD or this uh, cable plugged in USB. So we're just gonna unplug that bad boy and hit back, let it kind of readjust, be like, yeah, they unplugged that thing. We're good. We're good hit external data we got true and true now let's try and save to our music folder we're gonna say uh, Travis music test something like that uh, I did a previous video so a few of these directories already exist and you just want to make sure your spinner item is you want to select even the music because I don't think we set up our path at the beginning so it's only going to be setting up the path once we hit one of our spinner items. Now we're going to hit confirm and save. We got the toast down there that says file has been saved and let's also you know try and save to our pictures hit save. Yeah that's working as well and our downloads. So we're going to hit save for downloads as well all with the file name Travis Music Test. You can change that as well but just to save some time here. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go into our files too many applications here, too many games I play. And uh, in our files here, um, we're in the SD card 
I don't know if, if you guys saw that. You gotta hit the SD card because that's where we're saving to again. Okay, so we're gonna scroll. And I just clipped the video because I just realized something. We're gonna scroll down and it is right there. You can see it. But it's not going to open it because we didn't add an extension so it doesn't really know what type it is. So in order for this activity to work you guys want to actually add the extension such as uh, PNG um, test2 and it'll open up our, our actual thing. But if we just leave it as is it'll say un unable to open this type. So that's a good thing to note. Um, we could probably add to our, our file that we created just plus PNG after that um, if you guys want and then let's check our other folders real quick our music folder got Travis music test right there again we need to add the extension and it's probably it's in our pictures directory as well so just open it up test it yeah tra Travis music test as well so there we go guys um, thanks for watching I'll see you in the next tutorial